Excel offers some quick built-in tools for consolidating data. The first consolidation tip we'll share has to do with combining lists. In this example, upon returning from vacation, three separate families entered grocery costs. Some stores are in more than one list. I want to combine all the lists into a single list with each store represented once and the total across all entries reflected in the amount. To do so, I'll select a blank area of the worksheet. I'll need enough rows and columns for the final data set. Then select Data and Consolidate. You can perform functions other than the default sum, which we are using in this example. Ensure that both boxes under the Use Label In section are checked. Excel is relying on your headings to be the exact same. Watch out for extra spaces at the end of the text. Select the reference data by expanding and collapsing the reference box and adding the different lists to the All References section. When all ranges are added, click OK. In just a few seconds, Excel populates a new list containing one instance of each store and the total amounts. The new list is not in a specific sequence, so you can sort as you want. Note that the consolidated list is static. If you change the data in the reference list, it will not automatically update the consolidated list. This allows you to delete the original list and keep only the consolidated list.